Hey everyone, welcome back to Brickcraft, and today on my channel is the start of my Christmas videos, and today's video is going to be the cheap, easy, fast DIYs you can do with picture frames. And the first of our Christmas DIYs is this Scrabble letter picture frame. The materials you'll need for this are a picture frame, some Scrabble letters, a piece of balsa wood or cardboard, a star stencil, a piece of card stock, glue gun and glue stick, a pencil, and a pair of scissors. So first you're going to want to take out everything that is in your picture frame and put your glass to the side because we're not going to be using that. Trace around the picture that comes in the picture frame on the cardstock that you have chosen to be your background. Then cut it out. Put that back into the picture frame and put the back back onto the picture frame. Now you can arrange your letters how you want them to be. I'm having mine say, Oh Holy Night, in the shape of a tree. Then trace your star on the balsa wood or cardboard and cut it out. Paint the star, and then you can go ahead and glue all your pieces onto your picture frame. And you're done! Another way to make a cute Christmas picture frame is to use some scrapbook cutouts. For this you'll need a piece of cardstock, a picture frame, the cutouts, which I got mine at Michael's for $1.50, a hot glue gun and a glue stick, a pencil, and a pair of scissors. Once again, you will not need the glass from your picture frame, so go ahead and take that out. Then use the picture to trace and cut out a small square out of your cardstock and put that back into the picture frame. Then add your scrapbook cutouts. I made mine say Happy Holidays. But the nice thing about this is that you can change it to whatever you want. So I made one that also said Holly Jolly Christmas. And of course you can make it say pretty much whatever you want to say. It's as simple as that. This next picture frame is pretty cute too. It's just a Christmas stocking made out of a wood cutout. For this you're gonna need a piece of cardstock, a picture frame, a cutout of your choice, I'm using a stocking, a piece of string, a flat back or bead you can use as a nail, glue gun and glue stick, a pencil, a pair of scissors, a paintbrush, red and white paint, and some snow tech if you want. Go ahead and paint the bottom part of your stocking in red. Let that dry and then paint the top part of your stocking in your white paint. And when that's all dry, go ahead and add your snow tech. You kind of have to stipple it on like this and it's kind of flaky so it's kind of hard to work with but have fun and once again you don't need the glass in your picture frame so go ahead and take that out and then on your cardstock trace out the picture frame size using the picture that was in there cut that out and add it to the picture frame I'm using these little staple thingies so I'm gonna cut off the ends and this is going to be the nail for my stocking to hang on Glue on a small loop of string, glue your stocking to your picture frame, and lastly, glue on the item you're using as the nail. And now it looks like a stocking hanging in a picture frame. My dad isn't much of a Christmas fan, but I decided to make a Christmas geeky Star Trek picture to hang on the wall. For this, I'm going to use a piece of cardstock, a picture frame, some letter stickers, red, black, and white construction paper, a glue gun and glue stick, a pencil, a pair of scissors, and a glue stick. First, we're going to make the background like we've done in all the picture frames, where I just trace the inner picture from the frame and then cut that out. I'm using some red construction paper and a pencil to draw out the Star Trek symbol, the logo that goes on their shirts. And then I cut that out and glue it onto some black construction paper. And I'm going to cut that out, leaving a trim around the red. Using the cutout portion of the first logo that I made, I'm going to make the inner logo. And this is just to make sure I make it the right size. It's not too big and not too small. It's like a star shape, like this. And then I'm gluing it onto the center piece of the Star Trek logo. Cut out like a white flower shape and then a V puffy shape. This is gonna be the top and bottom of like Santa's hat kind of thing. But you're gonna glue that onto some black paper. And once it's all cut out, you can glue it onto the Star Trek logo. You get it? We're making it into Santa's hat. You get it? Maybe. Once that's all dry, you can go ahead and glue that onto the background in your picture frame. 
was kind of plain, so I decided that I needed to write something in the frame as well. So I decided to write something Christmassy and Star Trek-y. So I wrote Merry Christmas and Prosper. You know, live long and prosper. But that's all I have for you guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to stay tuned for my next Christmas video. Bye!